all is coming to an explosive end. My children, you are about to hear me roar, and that roar will destroy the plans your enemies just made against you that will never come to pass. I am your victory, and you will soon experience it. Everything on your computer is about to be released that you thought was deleted, but wasn't deleted at all. So Adam, prepare for your sudden departure from your position because it's coming. Save the Lord. What's up, everybody? Major Retire Richard Ojeda here. And y'all know those crazy preachers on televisions you maybe saw as a kid. The ones that jumped around and yelled about casting demons out. Sometimes you'd see a maybe more calm one, but they'd talk about you donating to their cause and maybe you'd get a miracle from God here and there. Well, thanks to social media and the recent explosion of crazy in the last few years, those people are now a dime a dozen across social platforms. And then Trump came into office and made them a central part of his campaign and strategy. Something significant is about to take place in Brazil. I told you before that an overturning of their election is about to be seen, and they are not the only ones who will experience this. Brace for what will take place to overturn this election in the land of my eagle. One of their recent favorites, a woman named Julie Green, is very good at telling Republican politicians exactly what they want to hear and getting their base all stirred up in that glory for God facade. The Biden's unmasking is about to begin, so enjoy the show. My children, all who have been wearing masks will be seen wearing them no more. What a nice life it must be to con MAGA people out of their money and grift off of the religious zealots by just literally telling them anything they want to hear. That is what this woman is doing. The same insanity that the QAnon conspiracy was, this woman is doing the exact same thing. And apparently Trump's son, Eric, is a huge fan of this lady. This all centers around the idea that Trump is the chosen hand of God on earth, that he was picked by God, and though he is a flawed man, he is godly and true. That is at the core of this idea. Also, again, these people suck money out of religious people. They've been doing it for years. It is one of the easiest cons in the world because they use religion to tell them that they are right and that they are doing what the Lord wants, and that Jesus is so happy that they'll get a shiny crown when they all get to heaven, and people believe that. They believe that Donald Trump will be graciously accepted into the place most holy and somehow not birthed into flames. If that isn't enough crazy for you, get this. She takes donations, but also has a form on her website for prayer requests and seems to encourage booking her for events. She also apparently got deleted from YouTube, probably because a lot of her, quote, prophecies have to do with politics, specifically those that also encourage insurrections. Again, these people know the stage they are acting on. Whether Julie Green believes in what she does is irrelevant because she actively encourages people like Trump and his son to use their fake beliefs to sell herself. And con artists seem pretty great at attracting other con artists. And that's a fact. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.